All right. So this is Soma. I don't know literally anything about this game. Like I know nothing. The only thing I know is that it's horror themed and I got it when it was on sale about I think like two years ago or something and I just never got around to playing it. So I figured I'd play it for the channel. Why not? So this should be fun. Know nothing about this. Looking forward to it. Uh, game mode. Save. Monsters are still creepy but can't kill you. That's pathetic. You don't need to worry about stealth as you play. Man, that's lame. Monsters are dangerous and can kill you. You need to think and sneak to survive. The way the game has designed from the start. Yes. Is that the only two game modes? That's lame. No. There you go. Yeah. I want to be able to make mistakes. That doesn't make any sense. Why play a, a horror game if the monsters aren't even going to hurt you? Doesn't it nice entirely make sense? I don't know if the audio is supposed to be distorted like that, but I think so. Because of that film grain thing on the front. I can't make out a single word they're saying though. I didn't check to see if the subtitles were turned on. Reality is that which you, that which, when you stop believing in it, doesn't go away. Are you okay, Simon? I think you're bleeding. Oh, that, that's nothing. It's just my brain can't stop bleeding from the accident. What? Here, take this. No, that that's for later, for the scan. It's green. Ashley, I need to tell you something. Simon, please don't make this weird. No, no, it's not like that. Why now? Who's David Lynch? Why is there never enough time? For what? I'm up. Hi, Simon Jarrett? Yeah, that's me. My name is David Munchie. We spoke earlier. The brain scan. I remember. Are you all right? Yeah, yeah, just a bad dream. Are, are we still on for today? Yeah, that's why I'm calling. I wanted to remind you to drink the tracer fluid I sent you. It'll help me capture a better image of the damages. Don't worry, I, I, I got it somewhere. Okay, great. Well, I'll see you in a couple of hours then. Okay, see you soon. Random. Uh, okay. Do I need to put pants on? Can I put pants on? Am I naked? Where Let's did I put the tracer it. fluid? To open doors and container, first interact with them. But okay. Oh, that's weird. I'm just gonna leave everything open. Open everything. Oh, that's so weird. Oh, I'm not a big fan of this. Come on, radioactive tracer fluid. Where are you? Come on. Lower the thing. There you go. Okay, that one's locked, I guess. Nothing but fast food. I should buy something healthier on my way home. So odd. I um, go that way. No. Oh, was it L1? It was L1, wasn't it? I'm gonna throw the salad. Throw the salad. Unhealthy. Empty the trash can. Just empty it all. I have a filthy, filthy house. And I'm gonna leave the fridge open. Man, I wasn't even joking. Like, this this house is filthy. Okay. 
Okay, I can't interact with my clothes. Okay, I don't want to mess up with the camera. I say that and I throw a book at it. <laughs> Let's open the shades. Open! The freaking... Thank you. No! Grab! Thank you. Summer's coming. Hope it's a good one. Get well soon, love mom. Uh -huh. Oh, I could have read that. Okay, let me try that. No. Okay, I pressed something and I was able to read it. What did I press? Whatever. Ah. It's the ocean. Nothing on the back. Very awkward picture. Okay. Pace Laboratories. I guarantee that's where I'm gonna die. Those are some awkward looking feet. You probably get a ton of money for those on OnlyFans. Meet and great book signing. 2015. Jesus. need to take a peek. I just woke up. You sure we don't need a peek? Close the lid. We're gonna flush. Why the hell not? Leave everything open. Turn on everything. Man, I'm not a huge fan of these controls. Lower it! the doctor waiting. I'll shower when I get back. I don't fucking care. I'm turning the shower on. Besides, that's gross. Why would you go to a doctor's appointment and not bathe first? Okay, they still want me to find this serum thing. Right. Watching TV gives me headaches now. Thank you, brain. Okay. I wanted the drawer. There it is. Is it? It looks like soap. No! Grab it. No! My god. My god, these controls. Got it. Uh, you can use objects you have acquired. Press R2 when the item is displayed on the screen. Don't they normally give you the dye at the hospital itself? Like for CT scans like and milk, stuff? But the taste. They, like, it's they, like, like sucking on a penny. Because I had a CT scan years ago when, uh, about a year ago. No, it's 2020. Um, I had a nasal surgery. And they, uh, they had to make a CT scan and they injected me with dye. Jesse. Simon, what's up? I want to check if you're coming to the store today. Uh, maybe later. I got the brain scan thing, remember? That's today. Maybe you forget. I'm sorry. Just send me a mail next time. I need these things in writing. You know that. You know how we sell calendars? 
You should get one. I have one! I just never write anything in it. Maybe I'll swing by later. Depends on how long this scan thing takes. That's cool. I'll just get Chris to help me out. Anyway, we're getting a new minion today. Thought you might want to come by and say hi. Replacing Ashley already? Hmm. That was quick. No, it really wasn't. We've been understaffed for weeks, and you know it. I guess it's been a while. It really has. Like, a month already? Anyway, get the scan done, get good news from the doctor or whatever, come down to the store, say hi to the new guy, and lunch is on me. Thanks, Jesse. I really appreciate your support. Don't want to replace another minion. That's not funny. It's a little funny. No. No, it's not. Bye, Jesse. See you later. Okay. There was no point to that train whatsoever, except for the phone call. Nah, uh huh? Let me check for subtitles. Uh, no. Controls. No. Ah, no. Subtitles on. Hello? Dr. Munchie? I thought he said Munchie. Like, I've got the Munchies. Oh my god. Hi. We've got a few hours. I where got... is everyone? I thought this place would be busy. Oh, where are you? We've got a few hours. I got, I got hold of Simon Jarrett. Let's do this. I saw your laptop in the reception. Are you already here? Call me ASAP. Hi, Paul. Talk to Pace about using the lab this week. I have, I have managed to book the scanner for tomorrow morning and again on Friday. It's not a lot, but they said we could use the empty reception area as a kind of office. It would allow us to use their computers to run models, and also if a time slot opens up, we can get in there and use the scanner rig right away. I thought we could run some tests tomorrow. We could do a scan of each of each other to learn the equipment. It's supposed to be pretty easy on Friday. I'm hoping Dr. Erin Peak, Erin Peak, will send somebody over. She has a patient that was recently in a car crash. She should be interesting. We're locked out. I found some extra time in the lab today. Unfortunately, nobody told us about the code change, so I called security, talked to Professor Wee, or Wei to have him vouch for our project and finally got a hold of some honcho over at Pace. Pace's legal department that could regret us permission to use the lab. I'm not allowed to repeat the code in mail or text, but I'll leave a note for something in case we forget. Okay, there's a PAX code somewhere. Uh, no. I wanna rotate you right round throw because you're not here you're not you're my doctor and you're not even here I'm gonna bring this chair with me it's my chair now. my chair now I have a feeling I'm gonna end up needing to do this anyway so oh shit uh what take the chair Of a chair. Fine, I'll leave the chair there. Uh, let's see. Like, obviously, I could try the door, but I'm, I'm like exploring. Let's see if we can find. No, it needs a passcode. All right, I've got to find the. Passcode. This is the place, right? It must be. Oh. Let's just call Machi real quick. Great. I got his phone turned off. That's okay. I can figure this out. Heating water. He said he'd write down the code just in case they forget. There's gotta be something I can interrupt. What about this? Aha! Uh -huh. Nope. Take this. Uh, 
2501. Not a huge fan of these controls. Two, five, zero, one. Found it! Too easy. I am the master of video games. Wait, is it a push? It was a push door. Now oh, you're locked. You also suck. I'm gonna need you later, aren't I? Alright, well. I don't think technically you're supposed to be doing this. More bottles! understand any of that. I'm not a doctor. Whoa! You jump. Can I do something with the needle? I'm not going to throw that because I think I'm going to need it later. I'm just going to put you back down. Oh hey, a light switch. That ought to help. More chairs! Oh! <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Open you. Nope. What about this last door? Oh yes, I can. Oh hey, a human! Oh hi. Didn't hear you come in. Simon Jarrett, right? Dr. Muchie? Well, it's uh, just Mr. Muchie, but I'm working on it. <laughs> Actually, you're helping me right now. Is this part of your thesis work? Yeah. It's a study I'm doing with my colleague Paul Berg. We hope to design a gentle way to work with brain reconstruction to help people like you. Oh, did you uh, take the tracer fluid? Yes, yes I did. Great. Well, we can start whenever you're ready. I'm not gonna be ready, period, because you're gonna be testing on my brain, scanning my brain and everything, and you're not a legit certified doctor? I mean, I guess you gotta start somewhere, but why am I patient zero? Please, have a seat. Oh. I don't like this. Am I going into the virtual world? Oh my god, it's not right online! Alright, let me just get this out of the way. You are Simon Jarrett, correct? Right. Toronto, Canada, David Munchie. Born 1988, July 16th. Right. Flat neurograph, version 6. Good. All files in order. Will this hurt? It's just a scan. It'll hurt about as much as getting your picture taken. Indians thought cameras would steal their souls. That's so. Well, huh. let's hope they're wrong. <laughs> Ready? That's a Say cheese. Thing to say. I knew it! It's Sword Art Online. What happened? Hello? Mr. Munchie? Did something go wrong? No, this went perfectly right. I guarantee he's a villain. You're his this isn't subject. funny. You're his test subject. I cannot see it. I'm not supposed to put myself in. 
This is kind of stressing me out. Hey! Anyone? Ah, now I can see. Everything's still distorted and blurry. There it is. Do not enter. Sounds good to me. I'll just stay right here. I'm gonna push a button. System console. Insert Omni tool. Okay. What Omni tool? I need an Omni tool. soon. Ah, it's hold R2. So, yeah, that's the toolbox. Would there be an Omni tool in here? Alright. Only thing I can think of. Did not break the glass. There's something out there. It says toolbox. Alright. Uh... Can I put on one of these suits? Switch. Aha, uh -huh. what does this say? Automated lock terminal. Unlock terminal from service console. Well, fight me. Alright, well, I guarantee you're supposed to. Um, this is. It's just not an emergency. Coach. You're supposed to. Ah! to say okay so it's like a card okay so I need the card in order to get the key thing okay so I'm looking for something maybe it'd be on a shelf a control pad. Damn it. It's like right in front of my face, isn't it? Because this is like the very first room. The very first room can't possibly be this hard. I'm just being stupid, aren't I? There's got to be something that I'm missing. Like, 
like I'm missing the key card. Yeah, the chip installer. How in the hell do I get out of here? point I wish a monster would just come right around the corner, break this window, and let me out. an eraser. Ah! I didn't necessarily mean to... Wait! There's a grate on the floor. Doesn't that mean that some... Oh, it broke through this. That's all it was. Alright. Well... I can't flip the switch again. I cannot believe I'm already stuck. Oh wait, maybe if I move the chair. How can I open you? Of course not. Ooh, so spooky. Where is this yellow card? Like, I would assume it has something to do with the freaking thing here. something, right, that I can, like, use and open up that, uh... Yeah, why can't I put on the suit? Yeah, because it says, always wear protective gloves and boots when op operating machinery. So put on the suit, you open the box, and it's not like it's hidden behind glass, I don't think. Is this glass? No! The only thing I haven't thought of is that maybe they're in the boot. Just put on these boots. I am so freaking lost!
I swear, if I look this up, which I do not want to do, and it turns out to be so freaking obvious, I am going to be so upset. I wasn't going to do this this time around. But literally, this is the first room and I can't find this stupid card. Yeah, insert Omni tool. That's not what I wanted. There's got to be like a button or something I'm missing. Looks like I'm looking it up because I've been in here for possibly 20 minutes already. Feels like 20, probably only been five. All right, give me a sec. Alright, the guy turns on the thing. Oh my god, don't tell me it was that. Am I that fucking stupid? Apparently I am that fucking stupid. Okay. Mm. I thought I had to stay in the room and that there was nothing I could do. But nope, I am just really, really dumb. Here we go. I am really, really dumb. Get out! Thank you. Now I can go and find a car. Not a lock thing on there. Can't you just, like... <sighs> Whatever. Okay, hopefully the rest of the game I'm not that stupid. I mean, I'm going to be stupid, but hopefully I'm not that stupid. Close. Oh. Someone taking a poop? Nasty. Ah. Uh. Uh. Oh! It's working. 
working better than expected. They're having a really hard time getting the doors open. Call Permaseal as many as you can, rather not take any chances. Roger. Did you cut off the factory floor? All done. Should keep most of them out. I'm on my way to lock off the comp set. Just make sure to leave a way out of here. Trust me, I'll get you the data safe and sound. We just need to make sure we're leaving our power running so we don't have to return. I hear that. See you back at camp. How did I do that? Can I open you? Nope, we got a look. Okay, I can't turn you. I tried. Or maybe I can because it started. Turned on safe zone. Safe zone. All right, time to not be a coward. We're gonna see. What's going on? Hi. Anything over here? There was two of you. Was it there? Super loud out there. Oh, hey. You look like a bomb. Oh, no. Ah! Don't do that. Lovely. Press R1 and move to lean. Oh, I hate these controls. Outlast did that, that, that technique better. Thank you. 
this? Why do I subject myself to this shit? Oh, this is like alien. It's like, I know it's there. Like, I know it's coming. And I don't want it to. Oh, fuck! I'm locked in here with it. Why did I do that? It's in here somewhere. I'm locked in. Why did I do that? I'm just gonna stay crouched the entire time. I, 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 mm. Simply slide operators into the main auxiliary slot. Okay, I can do that. Well, gone forever. You have a lot on you. I'm gonna want to remember to come back for you, but I'm gonna forget. Just stop. Just stop. Stop it. Alright. I gotta go back to that room and use the Omni tool. Which might not work because I don't have the key in it. I would lock myself in a single room and just starve to death. the other side of these locked doors. Okay. Swipe Omni tool. 
access denied. Okay, so I do need to go back to that other room. I regret every decision I've ever made in my entire life. There's a light, there's a light. I'm gonna do so well when I decide to play Resident Evil again. It's not this one, is it? No. Because of the fucking window, I'm shutting you anyway. Insert Omni tool to access. I have the Omni tool. Yes. Why won't you do anything? Luis Miron? Your Omni tool is in perfect condition but not fitted with a tool chip. Note that without a tool chip, your FST kit will be unavailable, including your cross site security access. To continue with your designate update. Okay, I need the chip. So that's out. Ooh! Multi chip. So now I have, why did the power go off? Okay, I can do this now, right? Pilot seat three. Pilot scan offline and front. Check everything in here. Hold on. Orientation. I know they told you that field technicians would get full access throughout Pathos 2. I'm here to tell you that's not gonna happen. 
Don't get me wrong, I don't want to get in your way. We need you guys to keep this place up and running, but there needs to be at least some level of security on these things. I don't want to hear you barge into some quarantined area at Omicron and just knock down the whole place with some virus or whatever the hell they're doing over there. This is what you can do. You'll be able to use it to open doors, basically all of them. If you can't, there's something wrong or someone didn't want you in there. Then what do you do? You shove that Omnitool into a terminal and see if you can't get around it somehow. I mean, sometimes you'll need to get it to places where you don't belong. Just find a way. You're an engineer for crying out loud. What else? Take care of your gear. Don't be an asshole. That's about it, really. My name is John Strohmeyer, Pathos 2 security operative. I got an office at Theta. Come see me if you got any issues you can't handle yourself. Good luck. So I need a Cortex chip. Cannot place my only tool back. All right. Well, trying to go figure out what I'm doing wrong with my life. All right, time to do something stupid. Oh, okay. I thought that steam was gonna hit me. Machines are the monsters. Someone watching. Fuck you. I ain't your fucking zoo animal. Alright, fine. That's the glowy thing. Ah! What was that? It, it doesn't hurt anymore. Okay, good for you. Ah, yes. Robots. 
assembly. Can you just, like, start chasing me already? I take it back. I don't want you to chase me. I take it back. Maybe because I knew what the monster was gonna be and it's gonna I knew where it was gonna come out and shit. And I don't know anything about this game. Oh please just stop. My heart can't take it. Just do your jump scare and like let's just start fighting. Oh my god. I genuinely don't know if I can. What are you? Uh, hi. Hey, can you hear me? Johnny Five? Plug you back in? Here, I'll plug you back in. I guess I can't. already. Don't touch the structure gel leakage. Can't confirm its effects on WAU. Issue has been reported to CCE. Okay. Oh, it's another one. somebody, didn't I? That was a human... Oh, Peter. Got. That was a human soul inside that robot, and I just killed him. something.
this did something. And I can't read that. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna press every button. R1. R trigger. Left trigger. Dial 1. D-pad. Left stick. Right stick. X, triangle, circle. And square, middle pad. R3, L3. All right, I have tried everything. Nothing is working. So, let's backtrack and go back in. Even though I don't think this is right. The only thing I can think of. controller keeps vibrating, you keep making weird noises, I'm waiting for you to jump scare me, but at this point I'm... Robot assembly. Okay, yeah, I guess that is technically where I need to go. Uh... Alright, let's follow this wire instead. did was breathe and it spooked me. Scan the Omni tool, there's not enough power. And you're dead. Like, I pushed this button, nothing happened. Nothing in this room happened. This just says, don't touch the gel. Okay, don't touch the oil. I've been doing nothing but touch the oil. Station control. Uh, okay, what do these signs say? I didn't even find the pathway back out. Okay, station control room. There's gotta be like a power station somewhere. Wait. Oh, okay, no, you can't. Okay, that's the exhaust. Exhaust. Process cooling. behind me or something, or is this the right way? Oh, that's a 
lot of symbol. Yeah, the, the door locked behind me, didn't it? So it's got to be something in that room. supposed to do with that computer. It's the only thing I can really interact with. I pushed every button. I can't do anything. It has to do with this computer. It has to. Alright. Let me try this again. Like, hold stuff down. X. Triangle. Holding things down does nothing. Alright, still got the walkthrough open. Let me see here what I'm doing wrong again. closer. Okay. No, not yet. Not yet. Not yet. There's the one. Okay. Are you kidding me? Jesus, I, I couldn't yeah, this little thing never popped up. Okay, so I gotta figure this out. Okay. Can you hear me? I hear you. Uh, Absalot, what's going on? Uh, I, I have no idea. I, I just sort of woke up here. In the room right now? Uh, it, it, was, it was like a, a seat with a helmet. Is that right? And what's your name? I, I'm Simon Jarrett. And what are you... Ah, oh, so... Damn, you ladies. Where are you now? Uh, uh, uh someplace dealing with electrical power. I, I'm not sure if it's a plant or a transformer. Uh, yeah, you're probably in a thermal plant somewhere. You want to go upstairs to the comm center. It's the room with the dome ceiling. Uh, hey, look, look, this place is not... There's something seriously wrong here. Hello? Was I supposed to stay in that I'm room? I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. We lost another relay. Just listen, head for the comm center upstairs. I'll wait here. Did she open the door for me and I just like left too soon? Okay. 
Yep, she did. Because I'm a dumb. I died. Press any button to try again. So I was right. The machines are the monsters. But how do you run away from them? There was no run button. Upstairs, you said you would be here. Check terminal for details. Ah, uh, shite. Oh, 
power doesn't move. There's no power. Okie dokie, I'm gonna go push the button. Wants me to throw things. Do I throw it at the fan? I wouldn't think so. Let's merge. God, he's dead? He's dead. Ah, the ID number, 0722, okay. No, systems have been turned off. If anyone ever has to return, know that the power flow regulator is hanging on by a thread. If you flip the switch, it's probably no turning back situation. We're out of here. We're out of here. Okay. Shit, no. No! Stop that! Stop that! Found shut down one of the highlighted sections to divert power to the communication center. Okie dokie. I 
don't know what you are. You're a fuse of some kind. Shit. I'm gonna need that. This black box is a precision instrument designed to uh, observe your overall condition. Oh, that's my health bar. It measures a wide range of data from the body temperature to brainwave activity. This information is constantly relayed to Pathos 2 Wonder Unit, so the station can provide you with appropriate climate for every situation. For optimal performance, please follow the auto injector instructions carefully, carefully to make sure the implant is installed properly. Ah! I need you! Come back! just fell through the floor. Screw you. Ooh, so spoopy. So spoopy. Fuck your detergent. Alright, put on the hard hat. Throw the hard hat. See if I can. Are you? Are you blind? It's me, Carl. Carl Semkin. Wrangler. Any of this sound familiar to you? I no, actually. Well, thanks for being so helpful. It's not like I'm knocked out on the floor or anything. Are you human? Shit! Did, did my body give it away? I try hard to stay a mystery. Yeah, I'm human. Are you? Uh, my name is Simon. Do you know anything about this place? Oh, you knew. That makes us slightly less weird. Look, I'm obviously hurt. If you see anyone else around, just tell them where I am. So, where are you, exactly? Are you for real? I'm right here. See me waiting? Look at my hands. Hey, buddy! Okay, okay, I, I'm, ju I'm just gonna be... I I'm not seeing it. I, I see a machine, a robot talking. What the hell are you looking at? I'm here! See? Uh, okay. I, I just didn't expect you to look like that. You're really hung up on appearances, you know that? So rude. How did you hurt yourself? Not sure. Blacked out pretty bad. Can't remember how I got here. What do you remember then? I was in the pilot seat, remoting a UH. UH? A universal helper. You know, a robot like these things, but livelier. Anyway, I was just dealing with some heat shields and... That's my last clear memory. You were remote controlling a robot. We do it all the time. Robots are too on a way to deal with some stuff. Intuition doesn't grow on motherboards, you know? Did you maybe get trapped in the robot somehow? Your mind is pretty tightly wired to the helper, but... Nah, pretty far-fetched. Listen, I don't want to alarm you, but I think you might be trapped in a robot. I'm telling you, get your eyes checked. I'm right here. I see both my hands. Both my feet. When you remote, all you see is like a video feed from the helper unit. Your own body is entirely out of the picture. If you see any others, just let them know where I am. I'm gonna push this button. Did I just kill you? Turn it off! 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 
sorry. I, I think I pulled the wrong lever. Oh, don't sweat it. Just get me a doctor. Oh my god, I killed a man. Well, not yet. I almost died. Oh man. I know you do. Oh, I hate to do this to you, bud, but I think I need a switch. Oh, wait, no. No, 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 I don't. There's a thing over here. Please. Won't a mechanic make more sense? You're trying to be fucking funny? Give me a medic! But you're a robot! Really? The robots have legs, hands, a face! You're delusional! Okay, calm down. I, I won't- Get some fucking help! Get me Holland! Yeah, now you give me a name! do this but I've got no choice. said no going back. it up. Carl was not my fault. Oh. Kill my friend. Oh, hi. Oh. All right, so there's not enough power. suits on.
Okay, so we lost quite a bit of power. In fact, practically all power. My friend dead. Hi! get different um like animations that's weird okay so i did that my friend while trying to avoid dying. Okay, I should probably start crawling.
way you saw me already. I forgot how to lean. Come and 
Room. Okay, this room should have power now. Wait for him to leave. Or go somewhere. 
Perfect terminal for DPS. Are you seeing me? Why is he coming out? I need to be going upstairs. Oh! No, no, this is familiar. I never went in here because this is where that guy was. Is there two of them? Sounds like there's two of them. and I'm too oblivious to see notice.
inefficient power. So I messed up somewhere. I've gotta be missing something. Okay, so there's storage. I don't need storage. I don't think I need So there are lights in here again. So that's what I needed to do. But it wouldn't let me touch it earlier. It wouldn't let me do anything. Alright, so the data detected restore files. Okay. Jelzy has me back on the lock. We got everything we need to move. But you can't leave the plant without supervision. Adams decided to leave Amy, Asaro, and Kalsanka to execute the automatization process. And I bet they're thrilled about it. I just wanted to let you know we're on schedule and I'll talk to you tomorrow. All right. I'll pass on the whole check. Josie, nothing going for an evac, am I right? It will do. I wanted to introduce you to Amy and Cal. They'll be doing the talking as soon as I leave for Theta. Say hello. Hey, Theta. Hello. Hey guys, I'm Peter Stress, King Dispatcher at Theta. Just let me know if there's anything I can do to help. I suppose that's it. I'll see you real soon. When we arrive. All right, Johnson, you have a safe trip. Hey, hello, Beta? Absalon, what's up? We could really use some direct contact with Heather. Uh, I mean, uh, Site Service Engineer Wolchek. Direct links are almost impossible to establish. The Lumar relays are basically junk at this point. You can send messages via the comm center, and if you want, I'm pretty much always here, ready to relay anything by hand. I know it's a shitty system, but it's all that works right now. All right, we just have to make do. Got you later. Hello? Peter, was it? Yeah, I'm here. What's up? We're getting out. I just want to tell you that I'm going to seal the comm center now, so this is definitely the last you'll hear from us. If we don't show up in the next couple of hours, send in the cavalry. Hang on, what's happening? It's still the same plan, right? Yup. We'll head for the shuttle and ride it directly to Theta. Okay, good. I'll rally the troops for a welcome party. <laughs> good, I like to hear. Hmm. Um, I'm not touching that yet. Yeah, Mr. Angry Pants, you're not getting in here. Okay, so... Is this possible? The 
office is closing down and everyone is being evacuated. From everyone here, I want to say it's been an honor working with you and Absalom. Godspeed and good luck with the apocalypse. Ooh. Update on defensive measures. Final efforts by global community to prevent collision has failed. Pathos 2 should t make any final efforts to deal with the inevitable quake following impact estimated time of impact. It is with great sadness I have to inform you that the office will close and can no longer support Upsilon and Pathos 2. I would like to take this opportunity to thank you, your survivor Jane Adams, and the rest of the staff. You're a terrific group. It's with great confidence I say that where we fall, you will surely carry on with bravery. I know you have a much better chance for survival, but we have a better we have a better view. Ooh. That sounds really good. You ain't getting up here, bud. Link broken, manual input required. Aw oh, man! Hey, are you there? I found the dome ceiling. Jared, Simon Jared. Hi, Simon. I'm Catherine. Have you figured out what's going on yet? Me? I was hoping you'd have some answers. I probably have some. What do you want to know? Where do you even begin? I mean, what is this place? How did I get here? And, and why do the robots talk like they're people? Well, you're at Upsilon, clearly. Have you never been there before? Where did you work? The Grimoire in Toronto. Is that really important? No, I mean, where did you work at Pathos 2? I don't know what that is. That's unexpected. Did you come directly from Toronto? Yeah, I did. And it was very unexpected. <laughs> Have you seen any people? Like staff or field technicians? Only robots. Crazy ones. Except for one. I think he said his name was Carl. He was okay, but... I'm... I'm pretty sure I accidentally killed him by turning off the power. Oh. Well... You know, robots don't feel anything, so... Yeah. What was that? No! What's going on? I think this place is about to collapse. What do I do? Simon, come to Lambda. Uh, how, how do I get there? There are several trains connecting all the sites. Find one and come here. I'll wait for you. Ah! Shit! 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 Where do I? Where should I? Oh, fuck! Did I just die? All I did was walk. Did I die? I swear to God, if I died just because I took a few steps...
What the hell? How is this possible? Oh, this is in my suit now? This is insane! I still can't like swim upward. Ah! Now that it's swimming, maybe I can jump this? Nope. Oh! Absolutely everything I expected it to be, and nothing like I expected it to be. Lambda, find the shuttle to Lambda. Lambda. But I'm bad at Because, like, just looking at the image, because, like I said, that's the only thing I went off of. I didn't watch the trailer, I didn't see anything. I just saw a horror game with puzzle aspects that was, like, um, on sale at the time, like, for really cheap, so I went ahead and bought it, but I never got around to playing it. But just by the picture, I thought it was going to be, like, you have to, either you were going to be in a virtual world, like this is what this is, it clearly looks like that's what it is, because you were uploaded via Neuralink or whatever. Or, um, you were going to be, it was going to be like Fatal Frame, which is another game I've never played. Um, and you would have to like, use your camera as your weapon. Or something like, because I just saw the distorted image. And I thought it had something to do with, like, security cameras. Is that one of those robots underneath here with me? Well, I hit a checkpoint, so I guess I'm going the right way. human the one that chased me kind of like um what coral was um, so 
So like that thing's human and it needs something from me. Or it was wanting something from me. So now I get the feeling he's gonna be hunting me down looking for me because I couldn't give him what he wanted. I couldn't even talk to him though to tell him I couldn't give him what he wanted. monster now but that Carl guy was human and he got transferred into a robot but he thinks that it like in his robot body he was seeing human hands kind of like how just now I was seeing my gloves even though I never put a suit on These monsters are actually humans looking for a way to help. Hi, let me, let me move all this stuff off of you, buddy. Hi, Fred. Are you friend? monsters they're just humans trying to survive and that one at the beginning uh, the one that was primarily hunting me down I'm guessing he lost like most of his humanity and now he's like more robot than anything else and he can't communicate that all he's trying to do is live but in order to live he's got to take something from me and what that is I have no idea but this is my theory is that I am also now uploaded into a robot and they need power from me of some kind. So they're going around and killing the other people. Oh my god, I, I have no idea. This is these are all fan theories and I'm not normally one for that. Found this shuttle for upload. Up Giant red bar. Can't do anything with it. Well, there's my friend again. Okay. Is that him? Oh no, it's just a light. <laughs> Probably just going in the wrong direction. Like all together. Oh uh, yeah. What does this one say? Is this uplift again? Yeah, I made it back. Illusion. For a second. Yeah, this is the shuttle port from Upsilon B. Is he trying to point me in the way I need to go? Is that what he's doing? Or is he just going around in circles? I gotta assume it has something to do with this big ass thing over here. Big ball. 
freaking me out, little friend. said B though and this is N or not not N. It's just regular. I am so lost. Ah another enemy. Or maybe it's the same one, who knows? substation? Yeah, I found a station. Did I just come all the way back? move anymore it's loading let's hope the shuttle still work I cannot see it thing how did I where did I get a flashlight my question is Jesus Christ! What the hell? Oh, that one ate me! Oh, I'm not touching you bastards anymore. Fuck you. Duh, I can crouch. I see light. That's no, 
not necessarily a good thing. Hey, a human! On a lot. Oh! Should I, um, put you out of your misery? Hey, are you. Don't hurt me! Can I help? You won't let me die. Nothing is allowed to die. What happened? An accident. Fixing the power. I was going to Theta. Anything I can do? If you see Masters or Holland, tell them I need help. Okay? Amy needs help. Not you or... Oh, God. No! I'm gonna kill her! Are you okay? Are you okay? I don't know. I want to go home. Uh, I'm gonna kill her. Oh, fuck. Powered, tracks powered, safety systems powered. Ugh. I hate that. But at the same time, I think that was better for her. Oh, I hate it. Now I'm a murderer. Times four with the uh, floodable airlock repair cell. Okay. Whichever. Shuttle J6 activated. Standing by. Hydroculture, 
turbulence and deep sea construction. We are now leaving Upsilon for Lambda. Lambda is Pathos 2's shipping dock and transportation hub. There you will be able to find shuttle trains leading to all the other parts of the station. And transports to this. Is that you? I was on my way, but then the shuttle train, it, it fucking crashed. Are you all right? The system says the section is sealed for suspected hull breach. No, I'm not all right. What the hell happened to the world? Why are we underwater? Well, you're really out of place, aren't you? Look, don't worry about that right now. I realize you're confused, but you're so close to Lambda. If you just keep going. How close? Can I walk there? Yeah, but the tunnel is locked off to protect the overall structure from collapsing. What you need to find is your section's maintenance hatch. It'll lead outside. Maintenance hatch. No problem. What is that? What's going on out there? I gotta go. See you soon, Simon. She's gonna be dead by the time I get there. Catherine? You okay? I can find Lambda, right? I mean, really, how big can this ocean be?
So is this like some Frylock thing? Because one of them said like, I think it said it's like the year 2100 or something like that. So is this like, I went into the virtual world and I woke up years in the future? Or is this virtual just set to years in the future as a test of sorts? Port. Please say Lambda. Or Lambda? No! Wait, what are you? 350. Oh, it's saying I'm 350 like feet or meters away or something like that. Just gotta keep on walking. Like a whale? Ah! Yes! Hello! But you're under rubble! No! again. That thing definitely used to be human.
there's someone down there I should have done, but... Ah, here. Push the button! Push the button! This must be Lambda. Or Catherine is. human. Don't let the circuitry fool you. I was human once. Can't take any more. This is... Everything's fucked. I give up. There's nothing left. Calm down. It's not the end of the world. You sure? It sure as hell looks like it. For all I know, there's no one left except for me. What do you mean? I'm right here. Don't take this the wrong way. But I meant any humans left except for me. Have you looked at yourself lately? You're a walking, talking diving suit with some electronics left on for good measure. I don't... You don't want to think about it, we'll start thinking about it. I, I, I don't want to do this anymore. I don't want to be this. I want out. Before you do anything hasty, could you help me with something? What? I was trying to find out what happened with my project when that brute knocked me to the ground. Your project? How could anything possibly matter when you know you're a stupid robot in a stupid dead world? Okay, focus. I need you to fix me so I can get back to work. Then you can sulk as much as you want. You gotta be kidding, right? I think I have a better chance of building myself a time machine than of putting you back together. All right, time for plan B. What's plan B? Oh, the Omni tool. The tool you inserted into the terminal. Oh, yeah, the door opener. Yeah, you can pull my Cortex chip and put it into the Omni tool. What's a Cortex chip? It'll be obvious. I'll eject it for you. Just grab the chip and slide it into the Omni tool. Come on, I just, I need you to do this one thing for me. Yeah, all right. Thanks. Should be easy enough. Just pick up the chip and slide it into the Omni tool. Why does a robot chip fit a door opener? It's standardized connect. Uh, Catherine? All right. Let's give this a try. Even though everything still looks 3D. Why can't I? Yes. Custom Cortex chip. Found. Shutting down hemorrhaging. Have a nice day. Just pretty much anything will fit. Oh, this feels weird. I'm in the Omnitool? Thanks. So, what's the project about? My project? Oh, well, I saved all the people on the station as brain scans and put them into an artificial world. We were going to launch it into space to save it from, uh, well, all of this. Are you telling me that you were going to launch a computer world filled with people into space? Yes. It was just a pet project at first, but it got really serious after the comet took out the surface. Then suddenly it became very important, and it was officially named the Ark. That's appropriate. How far did you get? I don't know. That version of me that I am. It came from a scan I did pretty early on. The living Catherine could very well have finished the project and launched it. I guess... 
she could even still be alive. Uh, weird thought. So the talking robots, are they also scans you did? They could be, but I doubt it. I'd expect much more sense if that was the case. Ah, all right, silent. What's happening? I managed to restore some data from the backup server. This should tell us everything we need. Oh. Could you do me a favor and run into the other room and have a look? I don't seem to be able to view the files in this condition. I need to know that the Ark is safe. Sure, Kath. Thanks. I'll unlock the door for you. Check the computer in the other room. Uh, I can't take my Omni tool with me? Well, you said before you from Toronto? Yeah, I just went in for a brain scan and suddenly here I am. That doesn't make any sense. How? Why would anyone bring a scan from Toronto? You think that's strange? What if I tell you it was back in 2015? Whoa. Uh-oh. All right, don't eat me. I don't think we're supposed to be doing that. All right. Can't make any sense to it. You say something? Sorry, still trying to figure out how you got here. Keep at it. I'd really like to know who thought sending a Canadian to the bottom of the sea was a good idea. overbearing. Yeah, it basically exploded with electromagnetism. That's bad for us, right? Confusing at least. This is a good punch. Ah, is it this? No. Hmm. Maybe it's this. Just one. check the computer. Yes, look for anything about the arc. Ah, there we go. Are you excited about the Ark? At first, I couldn't really see the point of it. But then I thought, why shouldn't we, right? I mean, if we are able to save even just a small piece of ourselves, why wouldn't we do that? So you are in favor of that. I think it's really important we do this. Hmm. What are your thoughts on the Ark? It's a great idea. Finally, we have something to do. Am I right? Are you optimistic about the project's chances of, um, about the Ark reaching space? Yeah, it can definitely be done. You already solved the biggest problem, how to actually get us all in there. Now all we have to do is build the damn thing. And Hope Phi is still operational. Yeah, I think we can do it. But it's not gonna be easy. What are your thoughts on the art project? The idea is just incredible. By every definition. <laughs> it really makes you think about what it means to be human. What makes you say that? Beyond the basics. Beyond the superficial, I'm convinced there's something with even greater value. You have provided a platform, which is not 
necessarily restricted to our digital progeny, but a means of actual survival. It's my sincerest belief that we can go on living through the reality of continuity. So used to being able to press X to do things. Is this from inside the Ark? Yes. That's some early renders of the world inside. Looks a whole lot comfier than this place. And then it turns out that this is the Ark and it crash landed. If you are reading this, you have successfully entered the ARC. This survey is designed to give the developers a better understanding of your subjective experience and how to improve your well-being. Please continue with the survey. How would you describe your physical condition? I feel invigorated, a better version of myself. I feel alien, I'm a visitor in another person's body. I feel fake, no longer a real person. <laughs> I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing this. How would you describe your mental condition? I feel disconnected, a separation from mind and body. I feel alter and a change in character. How would you describe your senses? As expected slash normal. I feel more sensitive to and aware of my surroundings. I feel blocked as if my senses are numb. I'm lacking one or more of my natural senses. How would you describe the sensation of your new condition? It's pleasant, I don't like it, something is wrong. It's like disconnecting, it feels everything, everything. I'm basing this off of the way that my character's been talking. Are you troubled by the fact that you are no longer strictly human? Somewhat, I feel like I lost myself. Yes, I mourn my previous existence. I don't care what form I take as long as I get to carry on. Actually, you know what? Yeah, I'll do that one. How do you perceive your new existence? It's a direct con continuation of my previous self, like a new chapter in my life, like being born all over again and a complete do-over. It's something completely different and has nothing to do with my previous life. Do you think this new existence will be a life worthy, a uh, life worth living? No. It's too detached from reality and everything I know. Would you rather be removed from the project and accept death? Maybe. I need to think about it. <laughs> no. No, no, no. Maybe. I need to think about it. Your answers are, have been saved. Thank you for participating in the ARC. I found a tracker homed in on the ARC. Oh, that's clever. I wonder if I thought of that. Does it still work? I really need to know what happened to it. I think so. It, it's doing something at least. Where is it? Hold on. I'm trying to find it. Please let it be safe. The Ark is not selected. I guarantee it's going to be there if I uh, do Earth. I knew it! It's on Earth. Ah, Canadian. No. In the middle of the ocean.
I found it. It's at a site named Tau. Oh, no. It's on Earth. It's so close to Phi, they almost made it. Damn it, it won't make it for long in that state. A couple of decades at most. That's not much to build a future. If we got to it, could, could we get on the Ark? I suppose, but I'm not exactly flexible at the moment. Alright. I'll take us there. I can move, jump, swim, sort of. You're stuck in the door opener, the Omni tool. I'll just carry you there and you'll show me what to do. That sounds really risky. Besides, I don't like the idea of you carrying me around. Come on, Catherine. This is what you wanted to do. Your final mission. Let's launch the Ark. We would need to find a way to get into the Abyss. Can't take the climber without a power suit. We probably have to go to Theta and pray that Dunbat's still working. Okay, so we go to Theta. I don't know, it's pretty far. Catherine, look around. What else is there to do? Maybe there's still a working shuttle train that can take us to Theta. I doubt it. Just have a look around. Push comes to shove, I'll walk there. Okay then, I'll just eject from this thing. Don't forget to take me with you. I won't forget. Can I pull the Omni tool out? Wait, wait, wait. Okay, just be sure to plug me in again at some point. You got it. Good luck, Simon. It's almost four, so that means I've been streaming for about four hours now, and I think this is actually a good place to call it quits for the day. I'm not, yeah, I can save. I was making sure it wasn't one of those. Either way, yeah, I'm gonna call it quits here. I think, because I think it was a short game, I think I'm about halfway there. But so far this is actually pretty interesting. I mean, I got stuck at the beginning and like that was just me being stupid. This isn't a horrible game. In fact, I thoroughly enjoy it and I'm having fun. Um, maybe I'll finish this off tomorrow. I'm not entirely sure. But I'm actually having a lot of fun with this and I hope y'all are too. And I guess I'll see y'all in the next video.